Up there, out there, on the high frontier, they're waiting for the final burn to put them in what they a scheduled orbit. That's what's happening at the moment. They want to fire those small orbiter um, engines that allow them uh, to maneuver themselves into that, for this mission at least, ultimate orbit. You hear a lot that this is a shakedown mission, nothing too daring being attempted on the first flight of the shuttle in 32 months. But correspondent Charles Osgood reminds us that this may be, in some ways is, the most daring and courageous shuttle crew of them all. It is dangerous, of course. To challenge the frontiers of knowledge or of space means always to put someone's life on the line. Experience has taught us that painful lesson. None of us has forgotten so soon or ever can forget. This is Freedom 7. The fuel is go. John Glenn reports he is ready. But remembering it, to accept the danger and to go ahead anyway, that is true courage. What these astronauts do is all the more awesome because they know so well the chance they take. They do it in the name of the others who have gone before and those who are to come. At such moments, they are mankind at its noblest and most vulnerable. It's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Excelsior, the ancient Greeks said, always upward. In a way, we ride with them, for how can the rest of us not be moved and inspired in striving for our own dreams by those who risk so much to reach for the stars? Charles Osgood, CBS News. Well, the next big event, it will be at 5.50 p.m. At 5.50 today, that would be Eastern Standard Time when they try to launch the so-called TDRS, the Tracking and Data Relay System Satellite. We will, of course, have uh, complete coverage of today's good news discovery up there and in orbit on the CBS Evening News later this evening. So until that time, unless there are developments, at which time, of course, we break in and tell you about them, Dan Rather with Bruce Hall. Thanks for being with us. We'll see you later. Have main engine start.